Should it start? Uh, basically, two ECG leads are connected with uh, two hands, uh, which is taking the uh, one 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 hand signal as reference and another hand signal as main signal. This is given as input to seven four one sir. I mean, this is given as input to my Arduino microcontroller. So Arduino microcontroller works as a data acquisition circuit. Now the uh, acquired voltage is very low. Therefore, this Arduino is given connection to 741 circuit. This 741 uh, is a three-stage uh, uh, instrumentational amplifier, which uh, increases the, I mean, which uh, changes the voltage to a gain of uh, say around 40. So the output of, uh, I mean, this three-stage. Uh, uh, amplifier is again driven by a power supply uh, plus minus 12 volt power supply uh, the output of this one is given back to microcontroller the output is given back to microcontroller again uh, that signal the microcontroller should be transmitting to your uh, PCB so this what my circuit looks like now we shall have another communication I'll remove this and I'll put this I will connect my ECG processing so one more thing you can see is as microcontroller start transmitting data there is a yellow color light which will be keep on blinking as it keeps on blinking you should be getting the signal over here so I should be able to show you both the things and when the signal acquisition uh, is getting over the blinking should be stopped and they will be getting this entire signal over here it's FFT value and it's filter waveform and muscle noise now in another specific case If you simulate a scenario, just keep moving your hands, generate muscle mass, keep generating muscle mass. So you can see as you keep on moving your hands, the muscle noise variation will be quite uh, high if I can move this yeah. so whenever you will be moving your hands at the signal acquisition is stopped okay uh, the variation will be quite high so in this way we can verify how the signal acquisition takes place okay.